Tamale South MP Haruna Idrisu early this month asked the Speaker to hold the Minister to Parliament to answer questions on the whole Vodafone deal. On Monday, the Minister with full emphasis stated government's position. Mr. Speaker, the government of Ghana has no plans of selling its 30% shareholding in Ghana Telecommunications Company Limited. Vodafone Ghana, which holds 70%, has transferred its stake to the Telesel Group in February 2023. Under the shareholders' agreement, the consent of the minority shareholder is not required for Vodafone Ghana to transfer or to sell its shareholding in Ghana Telecommunications Company Limited. Consent is not required under the terms of the shareholders' agreement. Still on the communications sector, government is seeking to pull the plugs on the digital terrestrial television channel but ningo pram pram mp son george sought clarity on if the ghana independent broadcasters association have been engaged far enough the minister said the time has come they have constituent members who are broadcasters on the dtt platform but none of them have paid a peswa to date for being hosted on the platform so it is not correct to state that any entity being hosted on the platform has paid for being hosted on it. They have not. There is actually matters pending in court because they have been notified. Others are adamant that government should continue to pay. But my answer is clear. The government says it cannot continue to pay for it. So if they do not pay for it, unfortunately we may find ourselves in the situation where we cannot receive TV broadcast signals because the platform will be shut down for non-payment of um, the operational expenses that it incurs.